Well, if you've ever spent hours trying to cover your kids' school books, our next guests have the solution that you have been waiting for. Please welcome to the cafe, Kay Gillard and Emily Goodchild. Oh, okay. Thanks, guys. Kay, how did Love These Covers come about? Because as a parent who has covered countless books, I think it's genius. So I'll just say that right now. Oh, thank you. I really appreciate the feedback. Um, it started, I guess, um, I stepped away from a corporate role. I went into semi-retirement. I absolutely love stationary products and I love kids. And it all started from there. So it was an idea that sort of um, arrived. Because stationery, so stationery is so cool, isn't it? Yeah. I've spent hours in stationery yeah, shops. Same here. Um, tell us about the book covers and how the idea actually sort of all came about from these ones. Well, I actually had the mums come and ask me. They had been using the document covers. They really liked the quality of the document covers. Right, so this covers. was the first thing that you made? This was the first thing, the document covers. Mm -hmm. um, so they were selling incredibly well. People were using them, and then the next question was, would I put together Plunkett book covers to protect the Plunkett books? And then mums came and saw me at fairs and shows that I was doing and asked would I move into school book covers yes. to protect the school book covers. So it's been an evolution. Because parents know that generally children want you to cover their books. They do. And you've been doing it with like Duracell and things. And if you've, I've just don't, I'm not a natural. You're either a natural at it or you're not, and I'm not. And it just <laughs> takes me forever to do it. And I'd get frustrated, then I'd start swearing, and then it was all bad, and the kids would beat. So it wasn't a good look at all. So this is a great product. Now, Emily, can you show us how easy they are to use? Sure. So what do you do? Oh, there's a book <coughs> cover. What are we going to do now? <laughs> <laughs> Put the book in. Oh, this isn't taking the hours that I do with the Duracell. You should have seen it. And I could never cut it properly, or the scissors would be blunt, or it would stick to me. It was terrible. Uh, obviously, very, very stressful here, Emily, putting this together, isn't it? Oh, it's <laughs> taking a lot of time, a lot of effort here. And you just stick it in there. That's awesome. So how do you come up with the cover designs? Look at that, just like that. Um, how do you come up with the cover designs? It's a little bit like putting together a, a clothing fashion range. You sit down with mood boards each season, um, and really it's about mapping it out and deciding what's fashionable, looking at what the kids have asked for. Um, that, for example, the, the insects cover, a lot of boys came to me at shows last year and said, oh, you've got to do bugs, we need bugs. Yeah, always need more bugs. Yeah, you need more bugs, and I mean, this one here, the off-road one, the bigger boys wanted to um, be out there in the dirt, so... I like yeah. this one, this is one of my favourites, yeah. the pineapple one, so you can have this. It also goes with your bag, but more on that in just a couple of moments. Um, Emily, so you are, um, you're a tween influencer, so you obviously you thought it would be a good idea to bring some tweens into the picture. I mean, so what input, what have you done? I've um, reviewed some covers and helped with some of the Facebook feed for like crafts and stuff. Oh wow, so you um, actually put onto that? Coordinate to the covers. And so do you go to Emily too and say, look, I've got this, this range of covers, what do you reckon? Yeah, we actually went out to um, the parents of, of our children last year and actually said, listen, we'd really love to see if we could bring on some teen influencers. And we had seven children that put their hand up and Emily was one of them. So over the past couple of months, I've received weekly packages and it's been all of the new season's book covers and the new product. Oh, excellent. So they've road tested it, taken it into their classrooms and... Um, Throwing it around in bags and stuff, because yeah. that's what you're going to have to do, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely. Stick them on books and chuck them around the room, essentially. <laughs> well, Emily might not do that, but I know my children actually did. And you've just brought out a new range as well, uh, which is bags, including a book and chair bag at the same time. So these are your gym and swim bags? Yes, those are gym and swim bags. And the other product that we have here, it's a, um, it's a dual bag. So it's Ooh. actually a, a book journal bag but you can also attach it to the back of the chair. It's got a gusset at the back, so they can take it to school, slide it onto the chair, and then at the end of the day, take it home. That's great, because we all know that kids at primary school have these book bags too, uh, which they basically then either lose or they, um, they, they rip. Well, I don't know, maybe my children are pretty rough on their things. <laughs> well, that's very exciting. What's the reaction been to these? Yeah, really good. Um, the teen ambassador, or the tween ambassadors, really love them, and we've had them on the market for a week now, and. Yeah, the reaction's really good. They're awesome. selling really well. Well, a great thing to do. Obviously, a quality control there. How do you actually get return business if it's so good? Uh, things don't actually break because everything's made so well. What happens? The key is in putting together some great new designs so that um, when the kids walk towards the stand or they look online, it's like, Mum, I've just got to have that design. I need the new so, book cover. Yeah, that is, I want the and, new ones. And that is clever. Yeah. Well, it's been wonderful having you both in here. Thank you so much, Kay. Oh, thank, thank you, Emily, you. as well. And if you would like to order any of Kay's covers or bags, just head along to 
her website, lovethesecovers.com, and use the promo code the cafe to receive free shipping. Also, we have four fantastic prize packs to give away, which includes both a book and a swim bag, and a full selection of book covers as well, each worth $50. So just head along to our Facebook page to enter.